hi guys welcome back to my channel i want to show you guys how i craft at night i got this container from michael's and it was on sale so if you don't have you a bedside craft table go ahead and go and copy one from michael's it is very convenient and i got the light that i'm using the clip on light from michael's as well i'm just showing you here how i curve my um wire and I take my time in curving my wire um, because sometimes you can make a mistake. And if you curve the wire too much, it may break or it may turn, um, not tarnish, but scratch the wire. And you do not want that. I am just carefully um, making bends. At first, I was going for a heart shape, but then it didn't turn out so heartsy. So I decided to go for an abstract look here i am filing down the end points of the wire because you don't want it poking anyone um, when they try it on or when they wear it so just make sure your sharp edges are filed down then i have four four crystals that i'm choosing from and i'm going to choose the one that best fit the shape of the cuff At this point, y'all, I'm just, you know, winging it at this point. I'm just making bends where I think it will be cute and just playing around with the wire, being sure to be delicate with it um, so that I don't scratch the wire or um, really over bend. Because if you bend the wire back and forth, it will snap. If it gets too um, bent, it will snap. So I'm just making um, curves and um circling and like just trying to do um some abstract bends here that i think will look cute with um this type of crystal um here i'm just making a small loop i don't know why but my nose cuffs turns out the best when i don't have direction um because as you can tell i tried to start out with the heart and it did not end out end up with the heart but it did end up really really cute Now I'm choosing which crystal is going to work best with the shape that I have made with the wire. Um, typically, you know, I already know which one I'm going to use, but in this case, I had four picked out. Um, I chose the Am Amazonite because it fit the shape best and it looked the coolest with this abstract type of uh, wire bin. Um, so you guys will see me put it in there in just a second. Now I'm going to take my smaller wire. Usually and typically I use a 22 gauge wire to wrap my um, crystal to the larger wire. Um, so I'm just fitting it there, seeing where I wanna place it and seeing where I want to wrap the wire around. Typically I choose um, where I think aesthetically it would be pleasing to the cuff to wrap. So that's what I'm doing now, just choosing my spot where I'm going to wrap. And as you can see, I'm being very delicate wrapping around the larger wire.
here I am just making any smaller um, detailing right now, just bending where I see I need to bend more um, and perfecting and trying it on the nose mannequin to see how it lays. I always do this um, just to make sure that it's long enough for the nose shaft and also that it's um, that the it's appealing to the nose. You don't want something too bulky. You don't want something that's too um, sharp or too wide for the nose. Like... Um, or doesn't look flattering so I always try it on the nose mannequin um, and so I just make any minor uh, changes that I need to once fitting it on the nose cuff I tighten my smaller wires make sure they're neatly on the nose cuff and that they look really aesthetically pleasing and then I create the clip for the back to hold the nose cuff in place And for the moment that you all have been waiting for, it's the nose cuff fitting time. I don't know. Maybe I should make a series about this for you guys. because This is my favorite, absolute favorite part of the process is fitting that nose cuff to that nose cuff mannequin. When I tell you it's like that uh, moment in my head because I'm like, oh my God, my work is coming to life. And I just want to see how it looks on the nose. Like... I don't know it just does something for me um, but this is my absolute favorite part and here is the final result results y'all tell me how you like this nose cuff tell me what you do and don't like tell me if you want to see more tell me what crystal you want to see next I want to hear from y'all what do you want to see from me going forward let me know in the comments and make sure you subscribe to my channel and also put the notification bell on. Later, y'all.